Regression analysis with scientific calculator. Example of regression analysis. Management of a soft drink bottling company has the business objective of developing a method for allocating delivery costs to customers. Although one cost clearly relates to travel time within a particular route, another variable cost reflects the time required to unload the cases of soft drink at the delivery point. To begin, management decided to develop a regression model to predict delivery time based on the number of cases delivered. A sample of 20 deliveries within a territory was selected. The delivery times and the number of cases delivered were organized in the following table. Here is the data of 20 customers regarding independent variable which is number of cases x and dependent variable which is delivery time y. We can find the summary part, ANOVA and significance part of model with scientific calculator. First of all when you on calculator then you will change mode from math to stat. To press button mode border with red color, you can see these options, you have to change mode from math to stat by pressing button 3 which is border with green color. After pressing button 3, you will see stat mode change from math mode. After setting stat mode, now you can enter data of X and Y after that you have to press shift button then press 1. In above slide, the mode button is border with yellow color while button 1 is border with blue color. After selecting stat mode, Press 2 because we are running simple linear regression model that is a plus B multiply by X. A is for intercept B is for slope and X is for one independent variable. The button 2 is border with yellow color. After pressing button 2, now you can enter data in X and Y column. On data entry screen, you will write 52 which are border with yellow color after that you will press equal sign to enter first observation of X. After pressing equal sign you can see the 52 value taken as first of X which is written in front of 1. Thus you have enter data value of X in such a way. After first entry you will automatically shift to second entry. Fill with same till remaining 19 observation. When you will write all 20 observation value of X which is equal to 298 then press down button to go first observation of X then press right button to enter value of Y in second column. By entering first observation of Y which is equal to 32.1 you will writ all remaining 19 observation of Y 1 by 1 thus we will write 20 observation of Y which is equal to 67.3. It's one important tip that is you have to check first observation of Y which is equal to 32.1 is same first row or not with X which is 52. Another tip is if you enter wrong value and you want to remove it. For that, you will press Dell button. If you find mistake in 15 observation you want to delete it by pressing Dell button. So, 16 observation become 15 and so on. So, you will delete all remaining observation from 15 to 20 observation otherwise rows value in both column will not match. So. Be humble when entering data in scientific calculator. After entering all data of X and Y, you will check it by pressing up and down button avoid other button. After entering data you will press AC button only. After entering data just press AC button, you will see above screen of scientific calculator. Be alert that you will not change mode or press data button to check data. If you press shift and then press one button, you will see a new screen of scientific calculator. In this screen you will see one is for type two is for data entry three is for sum, four is for variance five is regression six button is minimum and maximum value. It is important tip don't press one and two button. We specified type and done data entry.
Just press 3, 4, 5 and 6 get all measures one by one. When you get one measures you will come again by pressing shift button and then one button for each measure then the above screen will be shown and then you will find your require measure based on your formulas. There is difference when you first time press shift button and then press one button then you will see left side screen of scientific calculator. But when you enter data which are stored in scientific calculator and then second time you will press shift button and press one button then you will see right side screen of scientific calculator. Because data now stored and you will get required measures of regression analysis. There is no need to press button one or two. Because we have done it. Now we will press 3 button you will see the above screen of scientific calculator shown on right side. By pressing 1 button then you will press equal sign button, you will see result of sigma x square. Thus you will get all measures values. In next slide, summary steps of all measures are given. Sum gives above answer in scientific calculator of given data regarding eight measures along four steps. We need only sigma x square, sigma x, sigma y and sigma xy. By pressing shift then press 1 you will see the screen of scientific calculator given on left side after that when you press 4 button which is border with yellow color you will see screen of scientific calculator which is shown on right side. The right side of scientific calculator shows seven measures titled with 1 to 7 such as 1 is sample size and 2 is mean which is represented by x bar 3 is population standard deviation 4 is sample standard deviation 5 mean of y which is represented by y bar 6 population standard deviation 7 sample standard deviation. VAR gives above answer of measures given above along steps. We need only mean of x, mean of y, standard deviation of x and standard deviation of y. By pressing 5 button you will see this screen of scientific calculator shown on right side of slide. In this screen 5 options are given. 1 is a which is for intercept 2 is b which is for slope 3 is r which is for coefficient of correlation 4 is x cap which is for predicted number of cases. We don't need it in residual plot 5 is y cap which is for predicted delivery time. We need it residual plot by calculating y minus y cap. Reg gives above answer of measures along steps. We need only intercept represented by a in scientific calculator slope represented by b in scientific calculator coefficient of correlation represented by r in scientific calculator and predicted value of delivery time represented by y cap in scientific calculator. All measures result of reg regarding calculation steps of first 10 predicated delivery time press shift which is common for all y cap value then again you will press 5 button which is common for all 20 y cap value on individual basis. After pressing 5 button you will get y cap but you will write first observation of x with help of left button which is 52 prior to y cap. After that you press equal button to get first predicted value which is 32.11589876. In this way you will get all 20 predicted value of delivery time. Here is the last 10 predicated value of delivery time from x which is equal to 161 to x is equal to 298. Hope this table will help you get all value of predicted delivery time represented by y cap from scientific calculator. No need to add it. Just write zero when you total it. You will then find y minus y cap in separate column which are residual just find it manually and its sum is zero if they require graph otherwise leave it.
By pressing 6 button you will see this screen of scientific calculator shown on right side of slide. In this screen, four options are given. 1 is min x. 2 is max x. 3 is min y. 4 is max y. It is just for explanation but we can't need any minimum value of x and y and maximum value of x and y in regression analysis. All measures result of min max. Required measures of regression analysis. By entering data into scientific calculator, we get above values. It will help you to find all measures of regression analysis one by one. With reverse calculation we can find covariance because we know that R and population standard deviation of X and population standard deviation of Y. By multiplying R with population standard deviation of X and population standard deviation of Y, we get covariance is equal to 872.5025039678. By knowing covariance value we find the nominator value of covariance formula which is 17450.0500794000. By reverse calculation we can find maximum measure S of regression analysis and save lot of time. Calculations of intercept and slope of t-test by putting values in formulas we get intercept is equal to 24.8345395 and slope is equal to 0 0.1400026304. Calculations of SSR, SSE, SST, MSR MSE and F-test by putting value S in formulas we get. SSR is equal to 2443.4660 SSE is equal to value is 71.0315 and SST value is equal to 2514.4975. MSR is equal to 443.4660 which is same as SSR. MSE is equal to 3.9462 F test is equal to 619.1956. Calculation of standard error of regression SEYX, R squared and adjusted R bar squared by putting values in formulas we get standard error of regression which is equal to 1.985. R squared is equal to 0 0.9718, and adjusted R bar squared is equal to 0 0.9702. Calculation of p-value and critical range values of f-test We know that f-test value is equal to 619.1956 which is too large and fall in two values in f-test table which is very negligible such as 0. For help see p-value calculation of t-test calculation manually which is same for f-test. Thus we will tend to prefer critical range values of f-test to reject or accept hypothesis. Thus critical value of f-test with 5% level of significance and degree of freedom v1 is 1 and versus 2 is 18 which gives value of 4.41 in f-distribution table at 5%. Calculation of standard error of regression of intercept and slope. Calculations of p-value and 95% confidence interval of t-test for intercept and slope. You can compute manually p values of t test for intercept is 0 0.165 or 0 0.0015, which is significant at 5%. p values of t test for slope is 0 0.0154 or 0 0.0004, which is significant at 5%. By putting values of 95% confidence interval we get two ranges for intercept and slope where both intercept and slope values falls in that ranges given above. Thus results are significant.
MS Excel results of regression analysis of numbers of cases X and delivery time Y. After comparing results of regression analysis of MS Excel with scientific calculator we get same results. So you can save lot of time if you know how to enter data in scientific calculator and avoid length steps where necessary. For interpretations of all measures watch the video of interpretation of regression analysis link is given in description. Please subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper thanks for watching.